Um, so on this problem here, what I have is the square root of 2 plus the square root of 8 plus the square root of 50. Now remember, ladies and gentlemen, we could only add or subtract our square roots or either any of our radicals, any of our roots, as long as they were the same term. So right now I have square root of 2, square root of 8, square root of 50. I cannot add these. This is not equal to square root of 60. Okay? They have to be like terms, just like we add x's and y's. You, add, you can only add x's with x's, right? And y's with y's, x squareds with x squareds. So we can't combine these. The only thing we can do is say if we can simplify this. So I look at the square root of 2. Can I, do I know the value of square root of 2? Yeah. No. Can I simplify the square root of 2? Yeah. No. Then I look at the square root of 8. Sorry. Then I look at the square root of 8, and I say, all right, can I square, take the square root of 8? Mm, no, because I know the square root of 9 is, or square root of 3 is 9. So I don't, don't have an immediate value for the square root of 8, even though approximate value would be 2.8284271. But we don't want an approximate value. We want the exact value. But I want to see what square number can I divide? What square number can I rewrite with 8? And then so Cody would say, the largest square number that divides into 8 is? 4. four. So I rewrite this as the square root of 4 times 2. I know you had to be the largest number. You did, the largest square number. And 4 is my largest square number. Now I look at 50 and say, what's the largest square number that divides into 50? 25. Now, square root of 2 is still square root of 2. Then I say, all right, do I know the square root of 4 now? That's 2, square root of 2. Do I know the square root of 25? Yes, 5 square root of 2. And now you guys notice I'm taking the square root of the same number, correct? So now I can combine them up. So I have 1 square root of 2 plus 2 square root of 2 plus 5 square root of 2 equals? 11 square root of 2. Where did you, how did you combine? There was like five different numbers. How did you get 5? Square root of 25 is 5. Well, how did you get 8? 5 plus 7. 5 plus 2 is 7, plus 1 is 8. Remember, there's a 1 times this, right? So we got to remember that.